Finally tonight here, remembering Phil Donahue. Might be there seemed to be no topic off limits for Phil Donahue. What should we do is the question. For 29 years, his daytime talk show revolutionized the conversations Americans were having on TV. They lower the voltage down to 500 volts. The death penalty, the AIDS epidemic, women's rights, Chernobyl. That is the unit that blew last April. The provocative guests and questions. What's going to happen? You're finessing me here. The celebrities. How would you imitate John Wayne? <laughs> Just one line. line. Just one line. Well, all right, Pilgrim. <laughs> You're not upset if somebody comes up to you on the subway and says, Aren't you Meryl Streep? <laughs> Donahue often turning the microphone over to his live audience. You were very successful in the entertainment area. What led you to enter the field of politics? I'm still asking myself that. Uh, Millions watching him every day. He once told 60 Minutes he was aware of the attention and of the responsibility. I get a lot of attention. The money's good. Some pe there are people who think I'm smart. Uh, that would surprise the nuns who taught me uh, a long time ago. And so with all this attention coming to me, um, it'd be pretty foolish for me to take this for granted. It does not follow that I whistle to work every day. Nobody does. Phil Donahue died over the weekend at his home in Manhattan. He was 88. Tonight, Oprah Winfrey saying there wouldn't have been an Oprah show without Phil Donahue. He was a pioneer. Would you kindly welcome Marlo Thomas? and his wife, actress Marlo Thomas, who it turns out was a guest on his show before they were married in 1980, saying, as a man who spent his career loving his audiences, I know he would be very touched by the heartwarming thoughts and memories you've been sharing. I hope that you will continue to hold close those you cherish most, just as I was blessed to do with my beloved Philip. I'm very, very proud of the work. We kicked very big tires, we fought City Hall. Along the way, we entertained, and now and then too. He was a legend with a big heart.